Hello everybody, it's Tina from Tina's Messy Crafty Life. How are you? I hope you're good. I am here with hashtag 30 weeks of a pocket letter. I am on week 9 and I did this on a live a few weeks ago. So maybe the people that were on the live that morning won't remember it. And the ones that weren't on the live or didn't go back and watch it may not seen it at all or all that so here I am to share Boom. it's all about farming guys I am a farm girl my, my grandparents worked a farm they did not own it they worked for a farmer who had multiple farms and my parents owned a farm I worked farms as a teenager and I always have a thing I've always had a thing for cows I don't know why and even as a little girl they gave me a couple of black eyes because I was feeding them and their head would come up when I was a kid. Yeah, there's multiple pictures of me. I asked my mom once, what's with all these pictures of these shiners? She goes, you're feeding the cows in the barn with grandpa and you'd get hit. So, there was, when I ended up running through the storm door as a little girl, seven years old, six and a half, seven years old, I couldn't go in the barn no more. And it devastated me. And when I got to a point where I could go in the barn anymore, barn, because I was they were scared I'd get an infection, you know. And then when I was okay to go in the barn, I was still having a hard time seeing that my dad put a rope so I could follow the rope into the calf pen. Because that's where I always wanted to be, is with the baby cows. So, I was doing some moving around, putting things away from um, my yesterday Dollar Tree haul, and my personal shopper Dollar Tree Sabrina and the Mismatch Crafter stuff that I got from her which I paid for I send her money all the time <laughs> um, I was putting stuff away and I came across this cute little set I've had it for a while I bought it because I just fell in love with it always meaning to do something with it and I still got more left it was the down on the farm doodle bug design I just thinks it's so cute. Look at this pad ain't even open yet. Just fell in love with it. I got the die cuts. I got the stickers. I got the embellishments. I got the washi tape. The only thing I did not buy, and I don't even know if they had it, was a 12 by 12 paper pad. I'm actually going to look this up to see maybe if I could find if they did have the 12 by 12 paper pad because I would love to actually make myself a journal with this. So let's go forward with the pocket letter. This is the washi that came with it. This is the washi that came with it. So is this washi. The first roll is all the paper I use on the, this side is out of the 6x6 six six paper pad of Down on the Farm. So I'm going to show you the first roll. Um, not, I shouldn't say not all the paper because the grass you're seeing and the brown you're seeing is just paper I had. Actually, this is cork board. I used it to look like dirt. So here we go first little picture is I'm gonna, I'm gonna fold this so you guys can see better there we go there we go it's got the little back scenery with all the animals and the little farmer girl I put in I made some grass and then there's a little chickadee and then if you see this little itty brown spot it's actually a worm coming out of a hole, uh, hole. got the chickadee there's the other worm squirming away a flower a tree a pear tree and then over here, and I got the black and white, of course. I got the, the apple tree. I didn't have, they had a truck, but I used the stickers instead of the die cuts for this. And I didn't, I didn't, they didn't have the sticker for the truck like they did in the die cuts. And the die cuts were a little too big to use on this. So this is a Dollar Tree truck I borrowed or used, I should say. The little seed packets is from the sticker, so is the apple tree, and I got the little, and I used cork board, so it looks like he's driving on some dirt. Over here, I got a little pig, and apples, and little, see the little flies, and then I got the goat and the sheep, little piggy background paper, so that's what that looks like. And then the second roll is... Tina Louise, that's me, the little farmer girl, got some flowers, got the kitty cat, she's on grass and there's a worm, and up here it says first place because she won first place at the 
County Fair. Then in the center is, of course, the little barn. I love this paper right here. Look at the little cows. You see that? I just love the little cows. Over here is the little barn, with the sun, the background, of course, the mouse, the little chicken, the egg, and some flowers. Now, people are like, Tina, you have flowers in front of your barn? Yes, I do. And the reason I put flowers in front of my barn is both my mom, as well as my grandmother, planted flowers outside their barn doors. Don't know why, but they did. And then here's the little farmer boy, Scott David. There's that little worm coming through the, through again, and then that little worm. He's got the little pitchfork, and little puppy dog, and he also won first place at the, at the fair. And then over here, there's a little chickadee paper in the background. He's got little flies around him, because I tell ya, flies is the nightmare of cows. <laughs> <laughs> they just, oh, they drive you nuts. They always got flies around them. Horse flies. So you got the little cow, and he's got his little horse flies. You got a bale of hay, a little milk container, a little duck, and a flower. On this side, you have the truck, or a truck, tractor. A little chickadee on top of the tractor. I got the, the cork board again, and it's brown. Got the little fence, and it decorated the fence with some flowers. Over here is a horse. There's some flies around the horse as well. He's out in the meadow. And there's a chicken that wandered out there and got some flowers. That is that one. So here we go. Put it down so you can see the whole one. Just like that. And then when you turn it over, because you all know, if you've been watching my videos, I do both sides. Ta-da! Now, I was going to use different stuff on this back side, but I changed my mind. So up here, it's got like this, and I used the back side. This was double-sided paper. I forgot to mention that. Yeah, it's double-sided. Most of them is, yeah, it's, I did use them. Um, it's the back sides of the paper. I got our little animals, petting zoo, little rabbits, got some grass, it's cute, a little cow, an apple, and it says at the farm, I have a goat and some tomatoes. Over here is a house with some, or house, horse, oh yeah, with some carrots. We got the barn, it's on the cork, some corn growing in the field, and then we got the feed bucket. Over here we got the rooster and a hen and their chickadees. So, and then up here we got ew, which is a goat sound, I guess. Petting zoo and little ducks and sheep. Got the tractor in the field here. We got the little pig going oink, oink, oink. And one pig's nice and clean. The other pig got in the mud. So there we go. So this is week at nine's pocket letter. I thank you guys for watching. They gave me some cute comments. I've been liking them. Um, and I want to, as always, if, before I say, sign off, um, if you want to join in, join in the 30 weeks of the pocket letter. Well, it's not quite 30 weeks anymore, but you know what I mean. All you do is have to make a pocket letter. Use the hashtag 30 weeks pocket letter. 30 week hashtag 30 weeks PL in a description box of your video and just uploaded your pocket letter. You don't have to do it every week. You just do it when you want. I, on the other hand, I was doing it every week. So I want to thank you for watching. As always, be happy, be kind, be safe, be funny, be crafty. Bye for now.